Cash app me. Hey, hey, a cash app me. Hey, hey. Do you speak English? No, uh, speak English. Okay, say what you. Do you speak English? Okay, what you said to him. Do you speak English? And I said, um, sir, I'm using that. You was like, oh, 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 God. girl. Say the dramatics, girl, for the Oscars, girl. No, ma'am. He just want to be in the young crowd, girl, with all the, the with all the fab boys. He saw all the fab boys over there, girl. He wanted to be in the mix with the fab boys. And he was not giving fab, girl. Okay? Your ears are evil, girl. Because you're not that cute. And your hair is uneven. You look dusty. Hey, 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 hey. How you doing? Body twins. Body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins. What's up, Betty Army? Welcome to another mook. Friday, guys. Listen, it's a new day. We're here. We're blessed. We're never stressed, and we're so ready to eat. Wait, today's Friday. Yeah. Um. Cheers to the freaking weekend. Oh. Just got paid. No, we didn't. Party's bumping. Feeling right. The shaking. Left to right. Pump that jam. Gotta get it right. <laughs> Hope you guys are having an amazing Friday. It's the weekend, the start of the weekend. Now listen, girl, when I say it's been a hectic week, honey, but we're here and we're queer. Anywho, today we're having one of our favorite meals in the whole wide entire world, girl. Dotty gal. We're having some dotty gal, aka some jack dotty gal. We're having some jack mackerel in tomato sauce, but wait, this is simmered into the body sauce. Oh yes, body sauce. Period. Body sauce. Body, 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 body sauce. So we're having Jack Mackerel mm -hmm. simmered in batty sauce with some buttery white rice. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Buttery honey. And listen, we have the batty sauce smothered over it also, girl. And we have some sweet platinum baby. Wait, there's more. We have some summer crisp. Sweet corn. Crispy. The side. They're crisp. Very crispy. Oh, 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 yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's say our grace. God is good. God is great. Let us thank you for our food. Amen. And listen, before we dive into the scrumptious meal, make sure you grab a snack and come right on back. You already know. You already know. Period. And if you're watching and you're not subscribed. Oh, girl. I'm so tired of Like this video. For the and ring that notification bell. Bingalingaling! Bingalingaling! <laughs> that one kind of registered. How y'all hear it on the camera is so different. It, girl, it goes down it, into my. It echoes. It goes down into the depth of my soul. Hope you guys are having an amazing, amazing <sighs> Friday. Anywho, what are you guys eating today? Let me put some of this corn on this. Oh, we got a little more. Um, if you need any more gravy on the side, girl. Uh huh. I need that corn though. The corn is. Uh, can I share the corn first? Can I share some corn first? Dang. What's good, y'all? What y'all over the other one on a Friday? Friday night. But do I have no money? Oh my god. I'm very broke. Somebody please cash at me. <laughs> cash at me. Hey, hey, a cash at me. Hey. Hey. I would like to see it. A cash at me. Hey, hey. Oh, by the way, guys, the podcast is coming out, girl. Girl, I'm giving y'all. Listen, I'm getting to the thing. The thing. The thing. The thing. The thing. Talk about the body team. The podcast is coming, girl. Listen, go and follow the podcast Instagram page. It's Talk of the Tings podcast. Um, let's go. Talk of the Tings podcast. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'll leave the link down below, and I'm gonna, yeah. Follow the page, girl. Let me get honey, more. when I tell you this podcast, wait, we're gonna get into some things, girl. We're gonna get into some things, honey. Oh, girl, you got micro on this thing, too. Okay, ready? How you doing? Big mode activated. It, when we, when it's gonna be initiated, it has to be activated. You don't want it to be initiated, Carrie. <laughs> 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 
Mm. Why are we mm. like this? I, why are we like mm. this, guys? Okay. Guys, wow, it's 12 30. Mm. I haven't had all day. Yeah, it's a late night tonight, guys. Hope you guys are eating something scrumptious mm. today. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Mm. Ooh. Mmm. The body sauce brings a different taste to this. Ooh. As y'all already know, Dutchy Gal is already in a tomato sauce. Mm hmm. But our body sauce is more like, you know, girl, gives it, give it, it gives it some oomph, honey. Okay? Mm hmm. Put a little pep in the step, girl. Mmm. Yes, ma'am. Ooh, girl. Let me dive into today's TV, y'all. Before you continue to dig you, talk to the camera. You want to talk to my sister? Don't stop me, Craig. With I'm hungry. Don't do it. We interrupt this program to bring you a special report. We now return to your regular programming. I'm hungry now. When I tell you this man be ready to stand. Every day of your life, you are creating who you are and the experiences you will have in your life. Mm -hmm. Allow your inner wisdom and higher self to direct your actions and trust that they are right mm. for you. Message. If, if that ain't a message, girl, mm. I don't know what is. Y'all, this is so good. Mmm. Mmm. I was like, I did not know what to eat today. And I was like, you know what? I left the gym late and I know that everything else will be closed. So I was like, let me go to Walmart. Because, you know, shout out to Walmart. I'm going to need y'all to open um mm. 24 hours, though. 24 hours? I mean, 11 o'clock is cute. 11 o'clock at night is cute, girl. But I don't need that to open 24 mm -hmm, hours. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, 24 mm -hmm. hours, girl. 24 7. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 365 days a year. I would like to see it. Girl, so where is the, um, the spoon for this? Seven days a week. The same one for the corn. No, ma'am. We don't do that. Use one stone, kill two birds. No, ma'am. Okay, girl. Can, oh. It didn't fall off. Yes, it did. Look, it's right there. Where? Gary, it's right there. Oh. Sorry, my bad. I'm gonna wipe it on your clothes. That's the honest mistake. Calm down, girl. Not that serious. It's not like you was wearing white pants, girl. Or cashmere or something like that, girl. How are the girls doing today? What are y'all eating? Hi, she be able to show that. Mmm. 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 Y'all. Mmm. Mmm. It's a sweet pan, baby. Mmm. 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 Y'all, so I want you to do me a favor. Y'all never had this meal. Mm. It's a mackerel for me. Look at the mackerel. Oh, look at the heat coming out. Mm. I want y'all to mm. to keep Miss Juicy Baby in your prayers. What happened? Allegedly, she's in a coma. Um, I think she had a um a heart attack or a stroke or something like that. Allegedly. Oh no. So make sure y'all keep Miss Juicy in y'all prayers. Miss Juicy, baby, I love her. We need a speedy recovery, Miss Juicy, baby. Yes, okay? Miss, no, uh-uh. Miss Juicy, baby, we need you here, honey. Honey, we need you, girl. If y'all know who Miss Juicy is, we use a lot of her memes. And we love her. Mm. I think you're obsessed with her. You use her memes all the time. Yeah, because I watch the show. I don't think you watch the show. I've seen some of it. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I tell you I am hungry. Yeah, oh yeah, let me give you some tea. I was so annoyed at the gym today. Mm. There's just one man, right? He kept walking around, pacing back and forth, girl. He was doing the most, honey. The one that's talking met? No. But the thing that was annoying about it is he was pacing too close to people. Like, give people their space. The gym is so big, and then I'm there using the machine. He was on a, a, a same machine that I was using, but a different one. 
He had his bag and everything on the thing. Why he going he mind you, he's not using that one, right? Uh -huh. But he has his stuff there. He's gonna move his I'm using my stuff and I stop to talk to my friend. Why he gonna move his stuff over on the thing that I'm using? What? And he he clearly sees me using it. So I was like, excuse, excuse, excuse. Cause he had his headphones in, girl. I was like, I didn't even touch him. I was like, excuse me, excuse me, sir, sir. Hello, is anybody there? Do you speak English? No, speak okay, English. Okay, say what you. Do you speak English? Okay, what you said to him? Do you speak English? And I said, um, sir, I'm using that. You must say, oh, 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 girl. Say the dramatics, girl, for the Oscars, girl. No, ma'am. <laughs> no, ma'am. Because you saw me there. You just stinkly saw me there. Because I'm... Try me. Try me, bitch. Try me. Let a nigga try me. Try me. And then... It doesn't end there. Y'all. There is like three different pull-up bars. That's in the gym over the section over the way section, girl. Our part is occupied, right? I don't know why he doesn't go to the other two ones. He just want to be in the young crowd, girl, with all the, the with all the fab boys. He saw all the fab boys over there, girl. He wanted to be in the mix with the fab boys, and he was not giving fab, girl. Okay, your ears are even, girl. Cause you're not that cute, and your hair is uneven. You look dusty. You look dusty. Mm-hmm. So anywho, girl, I'm over there doing my thing, and I sit down and I'm doing my weights thing where you pull the weights into you, girl. Mm -hmm. I get up and I got up real slow, and then I'm taking a slow turn. Mm -hmm. Why this nigga go bump into me? Now you have all the space in the world, bitch. You could do cartwheels. Truly, honestly. <laughs> Why are you so close to me bumping into me? So. <laughs> I'm at wit's end right now, girl. I don't read my, I, I don't got to my limit, girl. So I'm like, what is wrong with this man? So I looked at him, I was like, because right now I'm thinking that something, something mentally wrong, girl. Mm -hmm. Instead of saying sorry, he gonna take his headphone out and ask me um, if I know anything he could do for upper pain, like up here. I was like, sir, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a chiropractor, girl. Was he an older person? He's probably in his late, you can tell he's probably in his late, four, early 40s, late 40s. Mm -hmm. But I've seen him all the time and he's just always fidgety and just doing the most. Like, I don't have people like that in the I day. was in the sauna too and instead of everybody be sitting down, he be doing the most. And it doesn't, it, he doesn't seem like he has a mental illness. He just does the most. Maybe he got a mental illness. No, he doesn't. I know when somebody has a mental illness. No. I would I would have understand you you know when somebody have a mental illness. I feel like he's just fidgety. But if you're gonna be fidgety, be fidgety in don't you, in, at this point you invade invading people's space. And he bumped into uh, my friend too. Oh because he just be walking so too close to people. Girl, it just girl. I was like and then he was getting in, in these other guys' way and they moved all the way out of his way. Why he followed them and started talking to them. <laughs> he was just pissing off everybody, girl. Everybody was annoyed at him. He just trying to make friends. Uh -huh. <laughs> Carrie, when you're in the gym, you're there to work out. And you can't just be up on people like that. That's annoying. You got to give people space. Mm -hmm. Like, if you if you actually was there and saw how close he was in your, in your space, you don't do that. You don't do that because you mess around and get hit with a whole dumbbell. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. Uh-huh. Mm. You get hit with a dumbbell. Don't play with me. Craig, you took an hour to tell that story. <laughs> oh. Girl, I had to get it off my chest, honey, because I have some type of way. 60 second story. Comment down below and tell me what y'all think. Did y'all like my you story time? 60 minutes. It happened today, girl. Mm-hmm. Anyways, y'all. Mm. This food is so good. The Real Housewives of Atlanta taglines are out. Mmm. They are out, honey, and I'm gonna play them for you, honey. I wanna hear, girl. I'm gonna play them, honey. Listen, girl. Mmm. Okay, so I don't know if I like them, but listen. Listen, you ready? Wait. So this is candy. I ain't never skipped a beat or a 
for a bag. That's Candy. I keep you on the edges of your seat. That's Drew. I always have the juice. Wait, you get that? I keep you on the the the, ed, the edges of your feet. The edges, the edges. Edge, yeah. Because the last Kira, I think they got that. Okay, so um, Marlo. I always had the juice, but now I got the beat. You heard that? No. I always got the juice, but now I got the peach. Can you let it play? Now I got the peach, yeah. Uh-uh. It's living in the moment when you are the moment. Oh. Uh, Spring, summer, or September, I'm the one you always remember. <laughs> Come on, Sharabi. Spring, summer, or September, I'm the one that you always, always remember. remember bitch, girl. bitch, you better rhyme like a rap stress, honey. No, not even that. She's talking about her, um, she by Sheree, girl. <laughs> Girl, you're, you're Shiba Sheree line too. 20, 20 seasons before it was dropped. Okay, the new girl now. I may be a rookie, but this isn't my first race. Mm. Oh, I get that because she's, a, she's a, a, a Olympian, so I get And that. she's a rookie on the show because she just came on. Oh, oh, yeah. I think my least favorite was Kenya. Kenya was very blah. She said, I'm I, Exactly, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot what she said. So who do you think is the best? Candy, because it's actually factual for real. Oh, Wait, no. what did she say? Candy said, um, play it again. She said something about a bag. She always getting the bag, girl. She stays, Candy stays with a bag, okay, girl? But I feel like this is redundant, I feel. She said it already? I, I would say that Sheree's old is the most, like, <laughs> funny. <laughs> for real? Girl, I don't even want to play them again, because they, they're kind of whack. What y'all think? What y'all think of the tag side? Which one is your favorite girl? I like Candy. It's Candy for me first, and then um, I like Sheree. What did Marlo say again? Yeah. Marlo said she's always been the, the juicy or something like that. The juicy something the she always had the juice, but now she got the peach. Come on, peach, bitch. Mm. And come to find out, they have a promo video that they did where they said, photo shoot, click. I heard that they was the one who did that promo on their own. Yeah. They did that photo shoot and everything. And Marla wasn't even there. They photoshopped Marla in that photo, girl. Girl, what's going on? Yes, I know she wasn't there in the video. The other video she wasn't right. There. So Bravo had the girls out here. The Atlanta girls do promo for themselves. Girl. Girl, the points are limited. Mm-mm. It looks like it's going to be a cute season, though. I bet they wouldn't do that for um Beverly Hills though, girl. Listen, the facts is facts. The real house of Atlanta put this franchise on the map. Okay, was it the first franchise? Mm -hmm. Was it the first franchise? Yeah, Atlanta was the first one. Girl. Mm. Mm -mm. So, the first episode comes out this Sunday. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna be at the edge of my seat. Yo, I can't believe that April is already done. I can't believe it. Mm. Oh yeah, so congratulations to Saucy Santana. Yes, sir. for signing a record deal with RCA. Congrats, Saucy Santana. You've been doing your thing, honey. Oh, now that's how you clear a bitch. Now that's how you clear a bitch. Materia Gora. Welcome like a dog, bitch. That is good, bitch. And my nigga pulled up on the breakfast club with new teeth, bitch. What? He did have new teeth? Got a bag and fixed my teeth, bitch. I hope you bitches know it ain't cheap. Come on, Santana, bitch. Come on, sir. And he's actually really talented, too. We kind of we kind of could have figured it out. I, I'm, I'm guessing that's why he got to tour with Lotto, because she's signed to RCA, too. And also, Doja Kitty is signed to RCA. So he's on a good label, bitch. That will push... Oh, his video's going to be sickening, bitch. So, I hope they give him the same the same budget as 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 Lotto and probably not as um Doja Kitty. So I think that's dope because I feel like he is apart from like Lil Nas X, he's like the one of the more the one of the the gay rappers that are going like really mainstream. That's gay. That's so I feel like he has been um doing this thing for the, over the past two years, and he's actually talented. Like he he gives me. A more talented version of the City Girls. Because you know the City Girls... JT could rap, but I don't think Miami could really rap. She always raps off the beat. Or against the beat. 
Yeah, but she does have some talent though. Like honestly, their songs they make dope songs, and that's all that counts. They make dope songs. So I feel like Sasha Santana is really good. He's a really good writer, and yeah, I feel like yeah, he's doing. I feel like these record labels know what they're doing, they, and the numbers don't lie. They know that he's able to make catchy songs that's going that's going to get a lot of views and on trend TikTok. on TikTok. They know what they're doing, child. These record labels know what they're doing. Mm-hmm. Now, the only thing about signing with a label now, yes, they're going to push you more, and yes, you're going to have a, a budget where your video's going to be better and everything, but you're not going to make no money. You make money off a tour. As opposed to you being independent, you that's your money, you uh -huh. know? But you're going to... They're gonna pay the labor. Are gonna pay for your your, your expensive ass music videos and stuff like that, and then they're gonna take all their money when you sell whatever single or whatever. They're gonna take all their money before you see a dime. So if you if they spend a million dollars on a video for you, girl, and you only make five hundred k, they take all that five hundred k and they're gonna keep taking it till they get and then you get your first check when they pass that one million, girl. It's just how it is. Mm hmm. The girls gotta get their coins back. Mm hmm. But talking about Sasha Santana, y'all saw the video where he's performing and they're doing some kind of prank while he's on tour. And while he's on performing Walking Like a Dog, they brought out two chihuahuas and mm -hmm. he got mad. He got mad and he threw water at the DJ and, and got off stage. And he explained that he's like, okay, people already see him as a comical person. From his viral videos with him and uh, the city girls. And he want to take his rapping career very serious. And why would you do that though on somebody's set? I'm, I'm, I understand if you do it like you in rehearsal or something. But people are there. Why would you try to embarrass people? Right. And try to do a prank while people is performing? And he said his whole thing is was they didn't do it to, to Lotto. They did not do that to Lotto. Because they don't want to mess with her. That's... She's they like, shouldn't be doing that overall. Yeah, listen. If I'm on stage performing, girl, don't 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 play with my art. Don't play with my shit. I am sensitive about my Your shit. art. My art, a r t. <laughs> I didn't say heart. No. I said art. <laughs> that would be you. I'm sorry. I know how to pronounce my words. And I. Oh. Anywho. Don't touch me. That was not shade, girl. Don't touch me. But you do have a heavy lisp. Anywho, I have a heavy fist also. Oh, girl. <laughs> girl. Girl, punch the wall. To the wall. But yeah, that was just, uh-uh. He said he's sensitive about his, uh, his whatever and you take it seriously. People come there, yeah, don't do that. If that, that's not part of his set, don't do that. Because you already want to give the people what they come for. And then y'all coming with this distraction and this clownery shit. Like, no. Mm -hmm. The niggas on tour. And then they say they choose. Out of all the venues, they're going to choose to do it in Florida where he's from. Yeah. Don't stop. Don't play with Santana. That man don't work hard. Okay. Leave that man alone. Oh, y'all. So. So, so, so. The Met Gala is on Monday. Oh, for real? And I'm surprised to see what the girls are going to give, honey. Yeah, May 2nd. Mm. So, what, which one do you want? So, today, um, this year's team, theme, when celebrities take the Met Gala red carpet on May 2nd, there will likely be no shortage of corset, boning, and boosting. Ooh, girl. I wonder if Nikki got That's because the dress code for this year's event hosted by the Metropolitan Museum of Arts Costume Institution, I mean Institute, is gilded glamour and white tea. Referencing the lavish era of American fashion in the last decades of the 19th century when industrialization rapidly amplified the country's wealth gap. So I want to see what the girls are going to give, honey. Good. They I said, wonder if Nikki's gonna be there. They said gilded glamour and white tea. Watch somebody show up on that damn red carpet in a wife beater with a corset girl and some pump shorts. I would like to see it. I'm ready for you to get into the fashions, girl. Oh yeah, oh yes. 
<laughs> I wasn't even thinking about it yet, girl. You already know I'm going to get into the Vashon. Why you wasn't thinking about that, girl? Because I, I, I knew it was coming up, but I didn't know it was coming up so soon. Oh, so, yes. Oh, girl, and I'm recording this weekend, too. So, oh, y'all going to have a few videos it's coming up. It's always the first Monday in May. Okay, so, yeah. Because I'm recording this weekend. Okay, y'all going to have a few videos coming up. Y'all... Y'all can wait a little bit because y'all, yeah, I'm just going to release videos back to back. Well, a few days apart. I don't want to overdo it, but yeah. But yeah, that's going to be exciting. Oh, girl, you know I'm going to read the girls down. You already know. You know, Lil Nas always bring it. Y'all see my plate, though? I was hungry. Can y'all Nas, Lil Nas always bring it. Mm. By the way, shout out to Walmart for having another inter international section in a supermarket, girl. Yeah. Shout out to them. Mind you, the Jamaican section need a bigger part, but it does what it do, girl. Mm. So y'all, I've been watching a few documentaries recently. Like I'm really into document um documentaries. Documentaries. And I like like murder mystery shows as well. Mm -hmm. So let me tell y'all what I've been watching recently so y'all can check them out also. If you have HBO Max, let me tell you what to watch. Oh wow! Why they didn't um? Why don't they don't show you what you watched? Mm. Guys, they don't show you what you watch on on. Oh my god! I don't like that they do that. Mm. Um, it's so good. What's it? What's it called? Um. Um, I think it's called Last Action Park. So basically, so about? I was watching a video with B Love and Darius. And they were telling me about this documentary that they watched. So basically, it is. A, it's a, whoa, whoa. <laughs> girl! I'm looking at you right there. You going instant? Girl! Oh I'm, my god! Girl, can I feel my food? What's thing? Dang! Oh my god! Really? So basically, in this um, documentary, that's it on HBO Max. It's called. Let me make, let me Google it and make sure because is it good? For some reason, I watched it, but you can't see what you last watched on um, HBO Max. Last. Um, it's gonna be in your theme. Um, Action Park. Wait, Action Park. You said last Action Hero. That's not what I said. Action. That's what your phone said. Park. Water Park. Action Park document. Oh, Class Action Park. That's the name of it. Class Action Park. And it is on HBO Max. Let me tell you basically what it's about. So, this happened in the 1980s, I think. Yeah, that's when it, it first opened. And it's basically, it was an amusement park that this guy had this brilliant idea of opening up in New Jersey. Right? But when I tell you that this man was the most careless man in the world, all he thought about was, all he cared about was making money. So oh, people wow. were coming to these amusement parks. People, um, he would be making rides that weren't um, made professionally. So people were dying. What? People were losing their tooth because um, he made like this water tube, this long water tube where it's dark inside and then you have a part where it goes like this. So, when the people are going through the tube and it comes to that part where you go like this, they're hitting up their faces on the top. And they're losing their teeth. And losing their teeth. Wow. So, I hope they had a dental plan. So, uh, everybody that went in there was coming out with like scrapes and stuff on there. And people were wondering where they're getting the scrapes from. When they went up in the thing, all you could see at the top of the thing is teeth. So, every time everybody come through it, the teeth would scrape them. The teeth from other people. So how did teeth get stuck? Because something was at the top. So when um, uh -uh. when when it's time for them to go through that part, their face go up on hit hit, and the, their teeth come out. What in the swamp? What in the mist? and what in the and people people knew that when you go there, you know you're gonna get either injured or die. But people would still go. <sighs> in okay, the nineteen. That don't make no sense. In the 1980s, Craig, yes. The documentary is so, it's so, it's really, really good. Yes, yeah, so everybody would go. Everybody would go. 
Um, everybody knew about it, right? So it was basically, so this man bought this big old land and um, it was like a part of land across the street and the other part across the street. And he would just build all these rides. They were not professionally built. So people were just dying, dying, First of all, dying. how do you, if you don't know how to build rides, how do you even... And you know what he also did too? He did it by himself? No, he, I mean, he hired people, but they weren't professional. And what he would do when they build the rides, he would pay his employees to, to test try or to test out the rides, a hundred dollars to test out the rides. Why he did to, to test out the rides <laughs> himself? And then in order to have, what you're telling the whole thing. I'm telling just, um, certain parts. And then, no, in, in, alert, in order to have a part like that, you need to have some kind of insurance. He made up his own insurances. Did he switch the guy? Oh, he made up his own insurance. What the hell is going all state? Made up his what own insurance. What the hell insurance, is going bro. on, bitch? Um, y'all need to watch Karen, it. Now I can't watch it because you don't tell the whole thing. Y'all need to watch it. Yeah, spoiler alert, bitch. That's and I watched something else too. Another Ooh, show. You know what I watch? Yeah. I watch Bling Empire. That Asian is that um, with the Asian with the Asian reality show with all the rich Asians, girl. Mm -hmm. What the hell is wrong? What's her name? Kim. Kim, why is you with Andrew? You don't see how Andrew talks to you and, and, and screams and gets mad, girl. He gonna hit you one of these days, girl. Are you still with... Is Kim still with Andrew? Her name is Kim. Girl, you better run for the hills. Molly, you in danger, girl. Andrew. Uh, Andrew played um Red Ranger in um, Power Ranger, girl. Oh. But nobody knew because he had a helmet on. But anyways, um, that man got issues. He got separation issues. He got mad at her because they went to Paris. The, the, uh, oh, my favorite person in there is Anna. I love Anna. I love Anna. So Anna took her as a birthday gift to Paris. Fly her to Paris to go shopping. Uh -huh. She's a billionaire, Kira. She comes from a family that's like billionaire. Okay. Um, yeah, so they um, went to Paris or whatever, girl. Mm -hmm. They flew on private on a jet. And... um. Because of the time difference, he was tired, so he was sleeping. So he was sleeping, and Anna said, "Come, let's go shopping to um to his girlfriend." So they went shopping. Mm -hmm. Why did he walk up and throw in a fit? Because they went shopping and didn't tell him what? Yeah, he has separation issues because his mom and his dad left him. But he's a grown ass man now, and he talks to this girl like he's her dad, screaming at her, and all she's doing is crying and talking about she loves him and she don't want to. She don't want to leave because um, she's all he has. But girl, you're going to stay in that thing and have this man treat you like dust? Oh, no. Like trash upon the... Like, like, like cans upon the trash can? Oh, hell no. Girl, I know he... If he has a, a physical abuse to girl, the way how he talks to you, girl, that's, the, that's the thing that's left. He going to hit you upside the head. I hope they're not together no more. This season was old. It came out 2021, I think. Yeah, Bling Empire. Y'all can check it out. I, I was, um, I'm still watching it. I think I'm on episode six or something or seven, maybe. I don't know. But I love Anna. Anna's my favorite person in there. She's so fabulous. Like, I want Anna to be my, my auntie. She's filthy rich. And it's not about the richness, too. She's so kind. She's really kind. I love her. And she's so adorable, too. You're really adorable. I'm trying to figure out this other documentary that I've been watching. I don't know why HBO Carrie, Max... forget about it. No, they're... I don't know why HBO Max is like that. Why can't you, um... Why the hell can't you... Forget about it, because you're going to tell the people the whole, everything that happened. No, I'm not. Yo, I don't like HBO Max. Why can't you see, um... Why can't you see... Girl... All right, so I've also been watching The Flight Attendant. It's really good. I started watching that stops. It's really good, Craig. So it's season two now. Season two is out, and I think every week they release a new episode. So the third episode just come on. I haven't watched it yet, but it's really, really good. That's the one she wake up with a dead man. She met the man, and she, she was dead when she woke up. Yeah, and, and he don't remember. He keep coming back to her and talking to her. It, I don't... I lost the, the, um, the storyline lost me, girl. I, I was over it, y'all. It was getting on my nerves. So I stopped watching it, girl. Okay, so the other thing that I've been watching, another documentary, it's on Hulu. This one is on Hulu. Girl, you've been it's watching called, Everybody and their mama. It's called Captive Captive Audience. And this uh, particular one that I watched, it was with a little boy that was <sighs> abducted at the age of seven. Okay, don't tell him no more. At seven? 
And um, <clears throat> he didn't get to return to his family until he was 14. It was really good. And there was so much twist and stuff. Okay, I want to... Yeah, that, A man, a man... Oh, oh okay, carry, carry, carry. Okay, That's yeah. not a, enough. That's, no, because you do too much. Let me talk. There's a whole lot going on in the thing. So what I'm telling y'all is just a tiny snippet of what happened. So it's No, a, because it's, you're telling the whole it's thing. It's a man that I abduct him at seven. Girl. And he didn't get to return to his family until he was 14. But there's a whole lot more to the story, girl. Make sure y'all go watch it. On Hulu, it's called... <laughs> y'all, never ask Kira if you watch something. Because if you watch it, bitch, he gonna spill the whole tea, bitch. It's called Captive Audience. Go and watch it. Okay? Oh my God, today. And his name was Steven. Steven. Steven Stainer. And they, they made a whole movie about it and everything. That's cool. So, yes. Um, this meal was amazing. It was really yes, amazing. It was. Guys, it was um, cooked down in a baddie sauce. Mm -hmm. If you haven't bought the, the baddie sauce yet, girl, the link is in the description. Remember, guys, to all proper sauce, you could cook down anything in there. You could do a beef stew. You could do nasty teeth. You could do some brown stew chicken in it, girl. You could do everything. Anything. It's a sauce. You I can even like put this sauce on pasta if you want to. Mm -hmm. Like spaghetti. Mm -hmm. But, um, guys, as you can see, the plate is cleared. Crime I have scene. a little piece of um mackerel here. Who wants it? Crime scene yellow tape. Nobody wants that. Well, we Crime have some more gravy over here, girl. Crime scene yellow tape. Ooh. FBI forty eight invest uh, forty eight hours, girl. Investigation going on. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'm filled with the Holy Spirit. My cup's running over, girl. Y'all already know. One time it is. One time it is. Today in the gym, one my time stomach. it is. My stomach was feeling weird in the gym today. Okay, so the first shout out and happy birthday. Happy birthday to Linda75. Oh, Linda. Oh, we always see her come at Linda. Linda. Happy birthday, Linda. Ha. Happy birthday, Linda. Ha. Happy birthday. Yay. One time for the birthday. Two time for the birthday. Three time for the birthday. Shouts out to Shouts out to Carlo. Hey Carlo. Drop the S. Carlo. It's not Carlos. Carlo. Hey Carlo. Shouts out to What's up? Shouts out to Daniel Turner. Hey Daniel Turner, honey, where are you going? Are you related to Tina Turner? Did you turn the corner? No. <laughs> Shouts out to Adult Nonsense. Ooh, girl, when I tell you, it's not only nonsense, girl, but it's adult. What the hell is going on, girl? You over there playing childish games. You're an adult. Stop with the nonsense. Oh, let me see. Some, I think a few new people made, um, did reviews of... Oh, for real? Um, the baddie sauce. Let's Shouts see. out to Madam Soul Food. Ooh, Madam Soul Food, girl. You are the Madam of Soul Food, girl. girl I would like to taste your green. But um, she tomatoes. did a review of the baddie sauce. Go on our community page to see the video. Shouts out to you. Come on, baddie sauce. Shouts bitch. out to It's Cam. It's Cam, what's going? Shouts out to you. Her, her video is also on the community page. And shout out to Hanging with Tab. Ooh, tap tap, honey. We are hanging with you, girl. Girl, we hanging like clothes on the line. Go check What's out the good? videos on the community tab, okay? The reviews are coming in, y'all. Yes, they're all amazing. Shout out to all of our new supporters. Shout out to the Friday ones. We see you, we see me. We see each other. You hear that echo? No. You heard it. Anywho. Is, Anywho, is the acoustics for me? And as we always say, every day is another shine. It's another shine. Okay, we gotta go, guys. Because <laughs> he's driving me up the walls. Yesterday, you were driving me down the walls, girl. He's driving me up the yesterday. walls, girl. I'm not Spider Man, girl. Every day is another chance to slay. So, slay my moms. We love, love and appreciate you guys. See Remember, you guys, go and follow the pod, Talk of the Things podcast. Um, Instagram page. I'm gonna link it down below because we're having a podcast. I don't know what exact day, but we're filming this weekend. So yeah, the <clears> first <throat> episode, y'all gonna get the first episode. The audio is gonna be on iTunes and it's also gonna be on Spotify. Yes, ma'am. And I'm gonna put it on some other 
streaming platforms also like Google I would Play like to and stuff see like it. that. And then y'all don't get the actual visuals on YouTube. So Period. Yeah. I'm excited. I hope you guys are ready. Let's ready. go. Love you guys. Love See you guys. all in the next video. Mwah. Body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins.